Hello students! Today's topic is about the process of particle size distribution analysis of fine aggregate. Particle size distribution analysis or also known as sieve analysis is a process of sieving the dry sample and weigh the retained sample in each sieve. The result of the dry sieving method is plotted on a semi-logarithmic graph with the grain size as sub C plotted on a logarithmic scale and percent finer as ordinate plotted on an arithmetic scale. Sieve test is performed to evaluate grading and to gain information regarding to particle size distribution of fine aggregate. The aggregate gradation influences the workability of concrete mixes because it affects the water cement ratio and the phase aggregate ratio. The sieve test is also performed to evaluate the finus modulus, the coefficient of curvature, and the coefficient of uniformity. Finus modulus is used as an index to give ideas about fineness and coarseness of aggregates. The coefficient of curvature and the coefficient of uniformity is used to classify a well-graded aggregate. A well-graded fine aggregates will enhance the workability and finishing quality of concrete. The use of properly graded aggregates will produce a dense concrete. The objective of this activity is to determine the particle size distribution of fine aggregate and to determine the finest modulus, the coefficient of curvature, and the coefficient of uniformity. For this activity, these are the following required equipments. Before testing, prepare the sample by oven drying the sun at 105 degrees Celsius for 24 hours. To determine the sample size needed for testing, first, sieve a 100 gram sun in a number 8 sieve. If the aggregate have at least 95% passing a number 8 sieve, the sample size is 100 grams. If the aggregate have more than 5% retained on a number 8 sieve, the sample size is 500 grams. Weigh the test samples according to the criteria. To proceed for testing, first prepare the sieves. This is the list of the following sieves needed. Stack the sieves together with the largest opening from the top and progressively smaller opening from the bottom with the pan at the bottom. Place the sand on the top sieve. The sieving operation is conducted by means of lateral and vertical motions. Keep the stack upright and occasionally tap the sieves. Keep sieving continuously for 10 minutes. You can use the mechanical sieve if available. Weigh and record each sand fraction retained on each sieve. Your data should be look like this. Sum all the weight and calculate the percent error by using this equation. The percent error must be less than 2%. Otherwise, the data is unsatisfactory and it must be repeated. Calculate the cumulative mass in each sieve by getting the sum of mass retained from all bigger sieves including the sieve in consideration as shown in this sample. Calculate the cumulative percent retained by dividing the cumulative mass with the total weight as shown in this sample. Calculate the percent finer for each sieve by using this equation as shown in this sample. Draw the green size distribution curve by plotting the data on a semi-logarithmic graph with green size as abscissa in logarithmic scale and percent finer as ordinate in arithmetic scale. By using the green size distribution curve, you can classify the sample according to the shape of the curve. It is a well-graded or non-uniform if it is a smooth curve covering a wide range of size. It is a poorly graded or uniform if it has a straight, nearly vertical portion 
indicating a deficiency of a certain size in that region. It is gap graded if the curve shows two or more well graded portion. You can calculate the finest modulus of the aggregate by using this equation. You can calculate the uniformity coefficient of fine aggregate by using this equation. You can calculate the coefficient of curvature by using this equation. Where D10 is the sieve opening corresponding to 10% finer, D30 is the sieve opening corresponding to 30% finer, and D60 is the sieve opening corresponding to 60% finer.
that's it. Hope you like the video, subscribe, and see you guys next time. Bye!